It's kind of been a lifelong plan. This was supposed to be my retirement job. I had this very romantic fantasy of being an old lady in a pencil shop, just talking about pencils all day. Um, I was just surrounded by great pencils my whole life, and as I got older, I developed opinions on them and had to import all of my pencils because in the U.S. it's really, really hard to find a really unique or really spectacular pencil, and I eventually realized like, there have got to be other people like me who are looking for these things that are hard to find. When I first started telling people very hesitantly that I was doing this, I for a long time didn't tell anyone what I was working on. They just thought I was unemployed. Um, even my mom, like nobody really believed me. Um, a lot of people laughed at me about it. A lot of people just didn't get it. Um, I don't think there was a single person, including myself, who thought it would take off the way it did. Opening a store is a lot harder than I thought it would be. It was kind of difficult to convince a lot of these vendors who make these pencils and sell them to um, sell them to me because of my idea was a little bit crazy and a lot of these places are in other countries where they don't have distribution in the U.S. The biggest challenge now is dealing with, with demand. We've had a lot of really spectacular press in pretty much every major outlet in the world and we're a really small business and it was really, really challenging just to keep up. Lots of sleepless nights. I think it makes a really big difference to be able to go to a place and talk to an expert and test the things out because you can buy a pencil online and you can read a description but especially if you don't know a lot about pencils that's going to mean nothing to you and just taking a picture of a of a really beautifully arranged set of pencils makes makes an enormous difference people buy that people like seeing things that look beautiful and so um i think because we work really hard to make everything really visually attractive it makes a huge difference it's kind of strange because everything that I wanted to happen to this business in five to ten years has already happened in one year and so I'm not quite sure where to go next. I do know that I don't want to open any more stores. One is enough and I think it's more special if there's just one. I, I never really signed up for this to be a business lady. I signed up for this because I really like interacting with people and selling them something that I love. Thank you. You're welcome.